So this morning I woke up at 5 a.m. for a bloody pee. And you know what you've got to do. You've got to lay there for an hour, not going for a wee. Then after an hour, realizing you didn't sleep anyway, and realizing you should have, um, well, you get up for a wee. So I went out for a wee. And for some reason, I went to Wales. <laughs> so, Penny fan, or as Google says, Pen Y fan. Um, it's been on my list for ages. I've just been waiting for weather. And uh, it's not a complicated one to go to and go and do, apparently. But it's beautiful. So the weather seemed good. And uh, got all my stuff together. And now I'm walking. So I should say, it's two minutes to nine. Um, <laughs> I've only gone that far, but <laughs> I'm already going, oh my god, I've just come off a cold, but meh. <laughs> I've done two mountain, well this is the second, I've only done Snowdon. Um, it's a very different vibe as Snowdon, it was all looming above me. This is a bit more mellow, but it's beautiful, I mean look at the, the landscape. made a different decision um, you know we always do that I, uh, I woke up and I was curious and I checked the weather and uh, it was good and then I started thinking of fuel costs which is a big one these days and some other things and, and then I thought well I know I won't regret doing it and sometimes you're not totally certain of that until you're in it and now I'm in it and I'm thinking it's 9.30 What else would I be doing? But look where I am, because I got in the car I listened to a funny podcast and I enjoyed it and now I'm here and I'm glad Just remember that when you're umming and ahhing about it you'll be glad of it Life is made up of better moments <laughs> Life is made up of better moments than laying in bed, enjoying that lion you deserve. Because honestly, how many of those do we really properly enjoy? Awesome. So I think that is actually corn dew, is it called? I should have checked that.
suppose it's kind of silly that they get a bit further down or a bit more along and then I'm compelled to take another photo or a bit of video because the uh, perspective changes and you know the shadows move along and like this bit it just looks more textured and yeah, it's just really beautiful so it's <coughs> just have that compulsion to capture it <laughs> I hope that's the cribbin I think you pronounce it like that I asked a couple of people and they couldn't tell me but it, it looks like it is it's the next highest peak and it's a bit along from Penny Fan which I still need to know how to pronounce that I remember when I went to Snowden, the bus driver said Penny Pass and that has a Y and he pronounced it E but Google says Pen Y I suppose I'll go with the Welsh guy because he would know <laughs> um, oh, my nose is running I really have chosen a, a great day for it it's so still and beautiful other people that have gone and done Snowden or, or Penny Pass I'm going to say it confidently now no, Penny Pass, Penny Fan um, they have gone and just been standing in cloud <laughs> um, and left. Oops, I did it again. Um, and what a beautiful day. Amazing. Right, up there we go. Shall I do it? I'm already gasping and panting, I might as well do it gloriously. <laughs> because why not? Ooh, this is why not. Oh, a minute now. This is cool. Here's a perspective. The shadow on the ground of the cloud. Very, very good. And then here they are. I think it's cool. That's Penny Fern. It's a nice place to be and um, yeah, I'd like to come and do some of the more challenging walks, maybe to the circular, something like that. Um, but today, I'm quite happy. So there are <coughs> generally circular routes that you can do here. Um, and that's really cool. Um, but I've, I've done what I came to do today. I knew that I wanted to do a penny fan uh, and that there was this other peak you could walk onwards to go and do, which is this one. Um, so all of that done, I'm going to just go back the way I came, enjoy that. But I'm buzzing with energy. I got to this peak here within an hour and a half. I got to Penny Fan in an hour. So, um, yes, I haven't felt the need to stop and eat or drink, but I'll stop for coffee with a view. And what have you? Beautiful. That snowed it. Um, going up was fine and great. <laughs> going down is where I felt my uh, knees start to scream, telling me that I'm 40. Um, I've had knee trouble for years, but so it wasn't an age thing really. It was a use thing, but I'm starting to feel it. It's the going down that hurts.
what can I say? I have had an awesome day. Um, well, it's it's only 12.20, so um, <laughs> it's only halfway done yet. A couple of hours driving, I'll be back home in Exeter. Um, it's been really awesome, really awesome. Um, Penny Fan is it's the highest peak in southern England, I think they say, technically. Um, and then, so, when you run up and you do it, you can, you'll go past Corn Dew, and then you've got Penny... Do I keep saying Penny Pass? I think I do. Penny Fan. Um, and then you can go onwards to do uh, uh, Cribbin. Um, and it was cool, you know, I've, I've taken uh, three hours, 20 minutes to do the whole lot. I, you know, kind of stopped for selfies and things like that to take in the view. Got, got to remember to do that. Um, I, I didn't stop for a coffee. I just didn't feel like it. I wanted to keep moving. And here I am, I'm back at the car, pretty much. You know, um, yeah, it's really good. Uh, my knees are screaming. That's, uh, that's the quads on the way up, knees on the way down, personally. Um, but yeah, I can't think of a better way really to spend a Sunday morning. Um, it's been awesome. W worth the effort, worth waking up for a wee at 5 a.m. and thinking, shall I? Yeah, always yeah.